Part of what makes this so hard for me is I have that kind of raging ADHD brain and so tiny spaces, clutter and chaos actually create a system where I can't function and even though I clean up, a bomb, it's like a bomb goes off even though I live alone. I'm not sure how that happens. The clutter shuts me down and I can't stay ahead of it. Lilith is doing her own version of cleaning today. She will be more successful than me. It's been a few days now since I made this commitment to stop trying to save everyone else and get back to walking and not just talking. Then we hit the nose bump, which still hurts, unfortunately, and is long from over. But all that is really just a mask for the pattern I am long familiar with but not comfortable with breaking yet. Finding the problem? Check. Finding the solution? Check actually putting the solution into action every day? Well, not quite checked yet. And it's about this time when a thousand distractions come into my focus. And the challenge now is not to wander off in their direction, but to stay focused on this one path of accountability. Because as much as I love freedom and I want wild, I can't have either if I'm unable to build the foundation on which they both must stand and then sustain it. Every day doing that work and not all the other stuff that so seductively calls my name. So today it's going to be short because the to-do list is long. So let's stop talking Jill and get to it. Um, and it's that time of year. It's going to be hot today. I need to change out the bedding. I can't even get to my desk. Oh, it's a good time for three breaths. Three breaths deep breathing and part of what's embarrassing and humiliating is to actually see what's going on here which has been what's so interesting about the actual vlogging is you can't lie when you look at yourself on video so today super boring for you super hard for me super short so we both don't have to deal with this We're done. See you in 24. <laughs>